The other day I took my dog to the vet for a dental cleaning. He was gone the whole day. And I was in my apartment completely alone. Even without looking for him, I could feel the absence of an energy in the space. Our pets, no matter how much we do with them in between the work hours, they will spend the majority of their lives in their homes. So they occupy this space in a way that's so different than I could ever occupy this space or my husband. My mind had become still despite the phantom feeling of wanting to look for him or give him a piece of food or expect him to run up on me. I suddenly had all this time for reflection and with it, this weird sense of freedom. I felt bad about that freedom. Looking deeper, I realized that there was actually an emptiness in that freedom. You've been gone. That no matter how good of a day I had, I went for a drive, I went to the grocery store, I, I didn't feel bad that I had left him behind or get anxiety about where I was going to use the bathroom because I brought him. It didn't matter. It made me think about how freedom kind of has to have a purpose. Otherwise, it's just nothing. And I didn't like the nothingness that came with that freedom. I enjoy the challenges that a dog brings. Because if not for purpose, if not for the act of sharing, what is the point of freedom? Anyway, that's my little reflection of the day. I hope you all have a good whenever time it is for you where you are. Thanks for watching. Thanks for tuning in. And I'll be seeing you.